So for this problem, we're given a solid region S, and we're asked to calculate its volume using whatever coordinates we feel are the most convenient. So here, S is a solid region above a square in the xy axis with vertices 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, and 1, 1. And then below a circular paraboloid, z equals 9 minus x squared minus y squared. So with these vertices in the xy plane, I actually think it's m the most convenient to calculate the, the volume just using x, y, and z. So let me project it into the xy plane just so we can get a little bit better idea of what our bounds are going to be. So here's the xy plane, and I've drawn my four points. So I'm looking at x equals 0, x equals 1, y equals 0, and y equals 1. So I'm going to take x and y to both be between 0 and 1. Now we know this square is in the xy plane, so our lower z bound is going to be 0. And the upper bound is going to be that circular paraboloid. So it's already in Cartesian coordinates, so I don't need to worry about changing anything. Now if I look at my bounds, z has a function of x and y, so I definitely want to integrate with respect to z first. And then for x and y, it doesn't really matter what order I go in. And since I'm finding volume, I'm just calculating, or I'm just integrating the function 1. And then I have dz, dy, and dx. So 1 integrated with respect to z is just going to be z. So I'm evaluating z from z equals 0 to z equals 9 minus x squared minus y squared. So I'm going to plug in that first function. And then for z equals 0, I'm just going to be subtracting 0. So there's nothing else there. So now I'm ready to integrate with respect to y. So this y squared here is my only function of y in the, in the integral. So I'm going to have 9 minus x squared times y plus minus 1 third y to the third. I'm going to evaluate that from y equals 0 to y equals 1. So when I plug in a 1 for y, I'm just going to get 9 minus x squared minus 1 third. And then when I plug in y equals 0, all my terms drop out. So let me move up here. And I'm looking at the integral from 1 to 0. of 9 minus x squared minus 1 third. So 9 minus 1 third, just a constant. So that's going to become 26 thirds times x minus 1 third x to the third. And I want to evaluate that from x equals 0 to x equals 1. So for x equals 1, I'm just going to get 26 thirds minus 1 third. And for x equals 0, both of my terms are going to be 0. So subtract these. And 25 thirds is going to be my answer.